Germany will start to produce hybrid weapon that will be a nightmare for Russians in Ukraine. The German defense concern Rheinmetall plans to produce hybrids of Leopard tanks and Sky Ranger air defense tanks at a plant in Ukraine. The prototype has already been presented in Paris at the 2024 Euro Satery Arms Exhibition. According to Build, Rheinmetall integrated the fighting compartment with the turret of the Sky Ranger anti-aircraft complex with a 35mm cannon onto the Leopard 1 tank chassis instead of the original wheeled boxer armored personnel carrier platform. This will allow the system to move over rough terrain along with other heavy tracked armored vehicles, making it a full-fledged air defense system for the ground forces. Rheinmetall representative Bern Bernard noted that the concern has many Leopard 1 tanks on the chassis of which Sky Ranger turrets can be installed and the integration of a 4.5-ton module onto a tank chassis could also allow for the installation of additional equipment that would be used to detect and track targets. Another advantage is that such a solution will help increase the number of ready-to-launch missiles in the launcher. It is known that so far the plant built in western Ukraine is mainly engaged in the repair of Leopard 1 tanks and Marder infantry fighting vehicles damaged during battles. However, in the near future, Leopard 2 transferred to the Ukrainian armed forces as well as tanks from other countries will be repaired there. It is noted that most of the Marder infantry fighting vehicles that come to this plant for repairs were blown up by a mine. The location of the Rheinmetall plant opened in Ukraine is classified. In the first half of June 2024, it became known that Ukrainian defense industry JSC and the German defense giant Rheinmetall launched the first workshop in Ukraine for the repair and production of armored vehicles within the framework of the created joint venture. The German concern Rheinmetall plans to launch production of Lynx infantry fighting vehicles in Ukraine. Ministry for Strategic Industries of Ukraine Alexander Kamishin said that we are talking about one of the most modern infantry fighting vehicles. Wildfires north of Los Angeles have burned 15,610 acres of dry, mountainous land. The fire that occurred over the weekend forced the evacuation of thousands of people across California. The blaze, dubbed the Post Fire, started on Saturday afternoon in the Gorman area. About 1,200 people were evacuated from the Hungry Valley State Vehicular Recreation Area. The wind continued pushing the flames south toward Pyramid Lake, which was also closed. The fire was just 2% contained Sunday evening. No injuries were reported. The cause of fire is under investigation. The National Weather Service issued a red flag warning for northwest Los Angeles County, warning of high temperatures, low humidity, and strong winds through Monday and possibly strong northerly winds on Tuesday. These conditions will be favorable for the rapid growth and spread of wildfires, including the ongoing post-fire complex, the Weather Service said. Multiple structures were damaged and destroyed, officials said without providing exact figures. At least one firefighter has been injured in the blaze, which has been dubbed the Point Fire, according to Cal Fire. 